Hello Kinda, here's Frau G and I have another real quick Quizlet tip for you. Um, currently we are starting to use Quizlet in our classes um, and I have gotten quite a few emails regarding the green check mark and how you at home can see and know whether you would have a green check mark on your teacher's end um, of the website. So that's what we're going to talk about today and I'm going to show you how you can find that information on your account. Uh, first of all, I want to show you what it looks like on my end, on the teacher's end, when we are checking for our students' progress. So first of all, I am logged in and this is just my home page. I then go over to library and I click on classes. I'm then going to look at my nuns group and I click on progress. And uh, you have seen this pulled up in class where we've kind of talked about, you know, who's been studying, who hasn't, and everything that is darkened is where a student has like pulled up that activity or studied that Quizlet set doing that activity. And then the green check mark is where they have completed it to 100% or they've spent like quite a bit of time on it. And the goal is that you are looking for three green check marks uh, to get this homework grade when we um, set this up for our classes. And so um, sometimes it'll just be, of all of these activities, you get to pick three random activities, um, completely up to you. You get to do whatever you want. And um, the further along we get in class, we usually end up uh, saying that we want to see flashcards, learn, and spell, right? But um, like I said, sometimes there will be an opportunity where you can even do gravity or match or test and get credit for that homework assignment. So now to show you what this video is truly about, let's go back to the home screen. So you are logged in and you're gonna come over here and click on your profile picture and click on profile. And then this is what will come up. Now on your end, you might not see uh, too many sets under study sets because you haven't actually created any of yourself. Um, but I see all of the study sets that like I have made or that I have opened up. Um, there's then folders and classes and under classes you'll see your social studies class and your German class. So those will both populate there for you. And then there's this drop down menu here where it says created, recent, and studied. And you're going to want to click on studied. And voila, there you see all of the work that you've put in in the last several days, weeks, months, etc. So uh, whenever you sit down and work on it, if you have just gotten to the point where it's been darkened, then it'll be darkened on your end and it'll look the exact same for me and just be darkened. Um, if you see a little green check mark here, that means that I see a little green check mark on my end. And what often happens with some of our super diligent students is that they have continued studying after getting a little green check mark and it doesn't really show up as 100% progress anymore on that home screen for that Quizlet set. And that's why you want to come to this uh, page within Quizlet to be able to track and see like, oh, that's right. Last Wednesday, I got a little green check mark uh, because I will still be able to see that information on my end. As always, we do encourage you to take screenshots of your work in case you're nervous or you're not sure if it'll come through because if you add screenshots to the assignment within Google Classroom, you're just adding more evidence and more proof of the fact that you've done the work and that can be super helpful. Um, so I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of the day and we'll see you in class. Tschüss, auf Wiedersehen.